Hello, this is Shante. Brown Sugar Talks Under Black Unicorns. So, y'all, how do you find out about fumes? Like, I know fumes, it's like, it gotta be like some kind of scientific test. It gotta be something, like, something that, like, measures the height of a fume. I don't know how I know so much about fumes. Um, I don't think it's, like, chemistry. I, I don't know what happened, but I have this fume that comes into my apartment like i don't know what this is duplex and so the fume actually turned the cornstarch yellow it actually like looks like it's burning it and it's coming from the furnace and i'm just like what the hell is the fucking fume you know i didn't call the gas company everything and i know that it comes from somewhere else but i won't say but i'm just saying like why and what is the fume and how can i stop the fume you know if it is coming so man i mean it i i was livid yesterday because i'm just like okay first you have like one hypothesis of what it could be like you'll be thinking okay oh it's just coming because of the heat or maybe it's because of the floor the dog is like went to sleep on me she looked at me like bye i'm asleep so anyway so it's like and maybe it's come from the furnace but then it all hit me because it came from nothing like it was just like out of fucking nowhere so you know when it's out of nowhere you really have dissolved all kinds of things and be like yep y'all doing it yep you doing that shit like it ain't even it's not one, two, three fucking questions, right? And you just like, you, y'all making that fucking smell come, you know, y'all doing that shit. I don't know what the fuck the shit is. I'm not accusing you of shit. I'm just saying, stop the shit you doing because the shit ain't, it ain't, it don't smell right. You know what I'm saying? Like, you over here fucking with us. So, I don't know, man. I was just like, that shit really pissed me the fuck off last night because I'm just like, ain't no fucking way. It ain't no way. Ain't no way. Then people call you bitches and hoes. And, you know, just shit. You just be like, nigga, I, ain't, I don't even know you. Like, I don't know you. I don't even have time to even insult you right now because I don't fucking know you. All I'm saying is, first off, get the fumes out and don't call me another bitch. You know, like, that's just how I feel. So it was just like, oh, my God. After, but I'm still having a good week. That's a good thing. Like, the best thing is I'm still having a good week. It's only Tuesday. It's only Tuesday. So, yeah, that was like my Monday night. Yeah, I'm tired, too. I'm sleepy. I think this is it for me. I'm going to take a fucking nap. I, I tried to post earlier, like, you know, because everybody's like, rise and shine. That shit is funny to me. It's not funny, but it's funny. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's kind of like you think it's funny. But are they doing it because she, like, she a billionaire? It's like, what is it? Like, what is it that's, it's funny, but it's not funny. I don't know. It's like, it's like you think it's funny. It's like one of those things where you put LOL and, you know, you don't laugh or whatever. Because I ain't really laughing. I mean, it ain't funny for you to me. The shit that is funny to me is Ari Lennox. Oh, my God. I love this girl, man. She is crazy. Like, oh, my God. I just like her sense of humor. I understand her. She could possibly understand me. Like, I fucking get her. Like, I fucking get her. You know, like, if I don't ever get another motherfucker, I get her. Like, she's so fucking black. Like, it is just so beyond me how black she is. Like, she just don't give not two fucka 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 fuckas. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I love it. I love It's like she would fucking eat caviar with a pistol. And you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I don't know. It's just something. It's like she is a mixture of everything. And I am too. I just love this girl. Like, oh my God. I fucking, I relent. Girl, mwah. I just, girl. Shape of the baby. Fucking up your pillow. Even though, like, yeah, like, unless it's, like, sadness or some shit. I mean, I don't know how she would have fuck up pillow. But it's like, man, I just, I fucking love her. I do. I really, really do. That is, like, the humor I like. Oh, but anyway, yeah, so I woke up my kids today. 
And he's like, Mom, I just don't want to go. Like, you just see the sleep on his face. Like, oh, shit. Because these people fucking with it. Like, ain't nobody got time for this. Motherfuckers got to go to school and shit. You sitting up here playing and shit. Like, you in fucking high school. Get motherfuckers out. Like, this the 80s and shit. Like, you in some kind of 80s type. Nigga, get the fuck out of here. Just fucking go to sleep. You know, people got other, people got shit to do with their life. You know, people be... You be like, why you do that? You just, how you do, like, what is it? Like, what the fuck be wrong with y'all? And that, that be the whole thing. Like, it's like, you need, you, you need, like, it's like, do they need help? Do they need a hobby? Like, what the fuck is it that you need to do for you to stop? Like, for you to just be like, okay, I got other shit to do. Let me, like, leave this shit alone. Nope. They just contest, continue, continue. You just be like, motherfucker. You know, y'all, man, We it's like people, I don't know. I don't know. Is it? I have never known. I just really, sometimes I try to figure out. Then I'm like, fuck it. I can't figure out. Then it hurt my feelings. I be sad and shit. It's like, I cannot figure out why people be fucked up and crazy like that. You know, I guess that's why they make comedy. You just It's just like, I can't figure this shit out. I didn't be in a therapy, bitch. Like, for real. Let me just make fun of this shit right now. So you just be like, man, fuck this. Like, man. And then people want, they always want to come with a fucking insult. I don't fucking know you. Like, I don't know you. Like, I ain't got no insultive shit to say about you. I'm going to cuss you out, though. But I ain't got nothing to say about you, dude. Like, I'm for real. Like, fuck that. Just stop the bullshit. That's all I'm saying. Stop trying to play motherfuckers fuckers like they dumb that's the shit that be pissing me off it's like man can i be a rapper i don't know i think that's why people rap too i be thinking shit that's why entertainers into fucking tame he be like these motherfuckers crazy and for no motherfucker reason i ain't i don't know you for motherfucking nobody and you you just oh, that's what the fuck you finna do that's all the fuck you gonna do that's what you gonna fucking do this what you gonna do with my fucking time and your fucking time too, just fucking up time. You just like, man, you you got other shit to do. It's other shit to do. You want to? It, it's other shit that you could be doing. Other stuff. Other stuff. It's like so many other things that people could be doing. And it's like, man, you just like, man, I don't know. I don't fucking know. Mistakes happen. Now sometimes mistakes happen. But you know it's it's some purposeful shit. You just be like, man, this motherfucker. So yeah. Anyway, that's where I'm at right now. I don't know. I can't. I can't. You got other shit to do, and you know you do. Do that other shit. Stop fucking with people, man. Shoot. Oh man, I'm so fucking sleepy. Anyway, I'm gonna take a nap. Everybody, please have. Like the best day, like the best day, the best day, the best day, the best day. You know, I know yesterday, see what I'm saying? On the show, I said I won't. Like, I'm trying not to be pissed off this week. And I I, I am, but at the same time, it's like, you got to, sometimes you got to let a motherfucker know. Because it just be like, you, I, ain't, I don't fucking know you. I don't know you. Like, I don't know you. I already told you what I, what I felt. I'm moving on with my life. Like, I think that people want you to. Actually, like I was saying last night, buy a ticket to they bullshit. Because even when I'm in the house, I heard the neighbor outside. Oh, she over there talking shit. I'm over here talk. I'm over here on the phone quietly going through my phone with my son. I'm just like, wait a minute. Is this bitch serious? I go to the door. I look out the door. She look over. Yeah, I hear you. Like, I fucking hear you. Like, I'm not do. Like, I don't have time for y'all bullshit. I'm not the person that started the shit in the first place. So why the fuck is it you now want me to buy a ticket and critique you? Like, I don't have time for that. You a grown motherfucker. You know what the fuck you doing wrong. You know what you doing wrong. You know what the fuck you doing right. Ain't nobody up here taking out your fucking comprehension. Your comprehension is comprehensible. If you can comprehend and pick up that motherfucking phone and call who the fuck you got to call, it ain't nothing wrong with you. Your comprehension is not fucked up. Your re, your your interpersonal skills are not fucked up. Nothing about you is fucked up. So at this point, since I know and have discovered and objectively looked at you and said, that, okay, this is not a retarded person, then guess what? I don't have any time to sit down and tell you what the fuck you doing wrong if you already fucking know you doing wrong. You see what I'm saying? People be like, and then they'll sit there like, like you actually supposed to come into their realm of their bullshit. 
I ain't got time to be doing that shit. Like, for real? You want me to actually be in the realm of your bullshit? It's just like, what the fuck? I don't have an opinion about it. And it's like, I don't. Like, I really don't have a fucking opinion. Because your grown ass knows what your grown ass needs to be fucking doing. And even if you're a kid, you know you do wrong. You know you do right. Some kids even look at you and say, okay, I did that. Okay, I, I, my, you can have my phone for two weeks. You know? It's just, come on, man. I, I'm just not that person. I don't know why people really think I be trying to fucking... I don't want to fucking judge you. I'm not God, bitch. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. But everybody wants you to have some type of conclusion about who they are and what they doing and all this shit. Bitch, live your life. I don't want you trying to have no conclusion about what the fuck I'm doing either. I don't need you trying to change my plans. I don't need you to be trying to redirect me to go the way you want me to go. I don't re- talk to me. You see what I'm saying? And that's the whole thing. It just seems like people setting up shit so I can give my opinion. My opinion is I have none. I have none. I, I don't have not one fucking opinion. I don't have an opinion about what you look like, what you got on, what you do for a job, how you live your life. All I'm saying is when it comes to me and my space... That's it. Like, just, that's it. Just keep our space clean. That's it. We ain't, we ain't asking you nothing else. We ain't saying nothing else to you. This nigga, he didn't call. How the fuck? You don't know if I'm a bitch or not. You you don't know if I'm a bitch. You don't know. You don't know if I'm a bitch. I don't know if you a bitch. You see what I'm saying? So why would I call you a bitch? You see, it's, it's just like, why? People want you to just have issues with shit that they do. Why? Why? That's what you do. That's how you live your life. And where that takes you and the information that it gives you and how it guides you is your own fucking business. Ain't got shit to do with me. Not one motherfucking thing to do with Shantae. That's all I'm saying. So, at the end of the day, that's it. That's it. That's all I got to say. I ain't got shit else to say. I ain't got nothing to say. Nothing. Nothing. But just stop the bullshit. Stop the games. That's it. That's all. Because I'm not playing with you. I don't know you like that. Especially when it comes to like my air quality. You know what I'm saying? The cleanliness of my home. All that shit. If you affecting that shit, hell yeah, I got something to say. But other than that, fuck you. I don't, I don't know you. I don't know you. I don't know why you have made the choices or decisions that you made or why you took the path you took. All this shit is a, a, a what is it, a, di- a dichotomy to me. It's a dichotomy. Do you like candy? Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes. Okay, then, well, you can go to cho- the, the chocolate factory. No, we'll go to the garden. You see what I'm saying? It's a dichotomy. People make choices based on the situations that they live in. No choices right or wrong. That's mindfulness. That's the wisdom part, the wise mind. That's what I just learned. So it's like a emotional mind and a um, a real mind or something like that, or some I don't know, a reasonable mind, reasoning mind. And so in the middle is the wise man mind, and it's going all sometimes it's going to be off balance. Okay, so what happens with mindfulness is like with meditation and stuff. When you go through the meditation, right, it's almost like you. You realize that no decision that you ever made is right or wrong. So you have no reason for the regret. You made the decision based on the information that you knew at the time. You did not make the decision because you were dumb. You did not make decisions because you were smarter. You did not make the de- decision because you were ignorant. It was because you had so much information or whatever information you took or you had an intuition about what was going on. So it's you either going to have the information or the intuition. So it's like you either one of those and both of those can be combined as well. And and it's going to move you through life the way that you have to move through life. No decision. Even if there was like a, a, a drawback from it. It's good or bad. There's no reason for regret because decisions have been made. No, and then when decisions have been made about you by other people, that was a power play. 
So it's like you cannot always just like think that somebody has a right to judge you or the right to whatever. But you do have the right to make sure that you're not affecting somebody else's health or affecting somebody else's environment or affecting different things about other people. That's not a judgment. That's a call where you just saying, wait a minute, I'm a fucked up ass person and I don't know why I'm doing it. So now let me think about what the fuck I'm doing. You see what I'm saying? It's nothing. It has nothing to do with anything else. And that's when you start to come into being non-judgmental.